Hi there, it's Amy from the Monshire, and today at our Monshire at home, I have a challenge for you. And I'm here at the sun, obviously not the real sun. I'm actually at the sun at the Monshire. The real sun is 93 million miles away, but I can definitely feel the effects of the sun. I see the light, I feel the heat. It's a hot day, beautiful out. And our challenge today um, involves these things. It's summertime and I love to make s'mores, but I usually catch my marshmallow on fire and then I have this black charred thing. I want a melted marshmallow. So what we're gonna be doing today for our challenge is thinking about how you can use the sun to make s'mores. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need your marshmallows, you're gonna need some graham crackers, you're gonna need some chocolate. I only had chocolate chips, a chocolate bar might be better, but these will work. They taste good even not melted. And then your challenge is to design a solar cooker. And so you have to think about how can I capture that solar radiation to make something heat up? And so what I recommend for supplies, some sort of box, you probably want some sort of foil that lets you kind of reflect that light and heat and concentrate it. You might want some sort of plastic wrap that might help to trap the heat inside of your cooker. And then you just need to design it. Think about how you could design it. Think about how you might want to put together. If you have a thermometer, even better, because then you can test how hot it's getting. And try it. See, can it mar melt a marshmallow? Can you melt chocolate? And if you do, you'll have a nice gooey treat to eat at the end. And if you don't, you'll have learned something. You could try a new design, see what you could come up with. All right, until next time. Bye.